Now, rugby writer and author Gavin Rich joins us as we sit down to discuss his book titled Our Blood is Green, The Springboks in Their Own Words, a piece that is truly an ode to the South African rugby experience. Welcome to the show. Thank you. Thanks very much. For Congratulations on this fantastic piece of writing. Why yeah. did you want to write it? Well, it, uh, it, goes, it goes back a long way, actually, yeah. why, how that book came about. I did Peter de Villiers' book back in 2012, and they contracted me then to do that one. Amazing. But um, it, I, didn't, I didn't actually start on it for quite a while, because yeah. I didn't actually really believe in it initially, because it was initially going to be a book just about locker room stories and, and yeah. that sort of thing. But then as time went on, and I did a couple of other books, I finally decided I better get this one out the way. Yeah. And then once I, I started tackling it, I realised it could be quite a serious book and quite a, an interesting book to do. And, and uh, I think, hopefully, it's come out like that. So, for really avid rugby fans, or just, I mean, everyone in the country at the moment is a rugby fan, why should people read it? I think it, it tells you what, it, what, the, what the, a lot of Springboks think about the issues that, that confront South African rugby. We've won the World Cup. Well, South Africa won the World Cup. We, I can say we. We are we South did. Yeah, of course. Yeah. <laughs> we won the World Cup. So, uh, you know, everybody, th you, can't, you can't really think everything's 100% correct yeah. r right now in our rugby because of that. But um, it is just, uh, you know, there's a lot of hope in that book I think and if you yeah. you get you get to you get to to understand quite a few of the issues in South African rugby and yeah. there's quite a wide cross section of ex Springboks who, who who talk in the book about the, the various issues that confront South African rugby, and it gets yeah. you thinking. There's so many issues. I mean, if you think about yesterday uh, in Parliament, the book of Springboks must fall, and then, yeah. you know, this case against Urban. As well. But f all of that aside, rugby seems to have the power to unite a nation, in my opinion. What is it about it that has that magic? Absolutely. Well, uh, th there is a lot of theatre in rugby, I think, yeah. which there isn't in other sports. And the late James Small is yeah. a guy who gets interviewed quite extensively in the book, and he says that rugby does theatre better than any other sport. And what he's talking yeah. about there is yeah. lining up for the national anthems beforehand. Some people don't like the haka, of course, but the haka also adds to the theatre. Yeah. There's, there's, there's just a lot of theatre. Yeah. And because of that, I think it draws people in, maybe more than some of the other sports do. Yeah. And it just... It, it does. I mean, in South Africa, because... because South the Springboks have yeah. done well historically. I mean, they've won three World Cups. Totally. So, I mean, hopefully it won't take another 12 years to win another one. Yeah. But, but, uh, <laughs> but, but, but it, it has. It's, it, it's united. And I mean, 95, I've got the 95, some of the 95 Springboks uh, interviewed in the book and also the 2007 Springboks. And, and they talk about the experience of, you know, they didn't realise when the World Cup started, just what an impact it would have yeah. on South Africa to actually win the competition. And, and, and I think these Springboks that are now, well, they've just completed their tour around the country, yeah. I think that they are now discovering yeah. exactly what it's like to totally. win a World Cup and, and how much support they've got. And Sia Khaleesi deserves it so much. He Absolutely. Is such an outstanding Absolutely. guy. Thank you so much for writing this book. You've just come back from Japan. You must still be on that rugby high. <laughs> um, a, a bit. But I've actually been trying, to be honest with you, I've got to go around sort of promoting the book now, but yeah. I, it's almost like I've, I'm a bit rugbyed out, to oh, be honest. Sure. <laughs> I had eight weeks of rugby over there. I can't imagine how the Springboks must be feeling. No, I'm sure. um, you know, they, they had to go around in the bus. I mean, I mean, it's great to have the yeah. adulation and everything, but some of them must be asleep now. No, and, they're and exhausted. Sleep, sleeping we wanted for weeks. them on the show, but yeah. they're exhausted, no. so we are still going to get them, don't worry. Now, you stand a chance to win one of two signed copies of Gavin Rich's book titled Our Blood is Green. Now, the Springboks, in their own words, uh, all you have to do is SMS the keyword rugby to double three six five. Zero. The competition closes at 5 p.m. today. So get texting. SMSs are 1 round 50 each, and free SMSs do not apply. And of course, uh, they all can be found on afternoonexpress.co.za. Thank you for being here.